Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if disk management cannot start the virtual disk service. This can happen if the remote computer does not support VDS or if a connection cannot be established because it was blocked by Windows Firewall. Additional information about diagnosing and correcting this problem, see troubleshooting disk management in disk management help. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and search for services. Best match, I'll come back with services. Go ahead and open that up. And then you want to scroll down and locate the virtual disk service and double click on it. Set startup type to automatic. Set the log on to Allow service interact with desktops. Go ahead and make sure that's checkmarked. And then again, make sure startup type is set to automatic. Start the service. And then we are also going to now just select apply and OK at that point. And then once you're done with that, close out of here. Open up the search menu and type in control panel. Best results should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. Set your view by up in the top right to large icons. And then you want to scroll down and select Windows Defender Firewall. And now on the left side, you want to select where it says allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall and select the change settings button. If you notice something that says remote volume management, you want to go ahead and check mark that option and then select OK. Otherwise, you can also go ahead and select allow another app and then browse for the file path as well. So that's a different option you can explore. So again, pretty straightforward process on that. And as always, thank you for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.